Hey guys, it's me Allie and you're watching my channel and today <sighs> we're fixing this room. It's tragic. It's like the worst this room has like actually ever been and I have just been letting it accumulate. It's only been accumulating for like literally two days and I've just been doing so much that it's just such a mess. So today we're doing some spring cleaning. We're cleaning my bathroom, we're cleaning my room, we're cleaning my closet. Everything is going to be decluttered cleaned and organized because this is like actually bad i have been having so much fun the past couple of days but then i come home to my room and it's like disgusting that i feel like gross even if i'm clean i feel gross in my own like surroundings because everything is just so messy so we really really need to do this and i was gonna push it off till sunday because i had like a lot of plans for this weekend but i was like okay no no we're staying in tonight it's a friday night we didn't have school today so i spent the entire day at the beach I'm literally boiling because of like the sun I got today. It's so hot in here right now and I just got out of the shower. A cold shower by the way. But I can't wait any longer. So let me show you guys the before. And I really hope the after doesn't take that long because it's currently 9.30 at night. But honestly, I don't care how long it takes to be honest because this is bad and it needs to be organized. So let's get going because we have a lot of work to do. So let me show you guys what the current state of my room is. I'll tell you guys from the entrance. So this is the first look when you walk into my room. <laughs> we have the bathing suit I wore today, my laundry, a new pair of shoes, my prom dress. Then we look at my desk. I have all the jewelry that I got out of my flag football bag. Because every single time we have a game, I have a new set of earrings, a new necklace on, and I have to take it off. So I literally accumulated my entire jewelry collection in my flag football bag. So... We had to take it out today. We have Sol de Janeiro everywhere because they just sent us a package. Hair from my hairbrush. Oh my gosh, it's actually so bad, guys. And then my bed, which I need to make, which I haven't made, clearly. And then just, okay, look how beautiful. And then boom. The most tragic of all, my closet. This is because I couldn't pick out an outfit. I am the most indecisive human being and this is proof of it because I went through, I kid you not, like every hoodie in my freaking closet, every tank top just to wear jean shorts and a hoodie. Like why did I have to make this ginormous mess? So if you guys have watched a closet clean out before, you guys know the ritual. We're going to go through all the shelves, organize everything, through the shoes, through the top, and we're going to organize everything and get rid of what we don't want to wear anymore. You guys love these types of videos, so let's get started. Let's clean this room because it's honestly just making me mad. Okay, so I guess I'm going to start here. <sighs> And I guess we're going to begin in the worst spot because once like this is like organized, I feel like a lot of the room is going to get put together because it's like my laundry basket needs to get put away. There's clothes all over my floor. So we just need to start with the closet, but I don't know what to do. Okay, I'm going to, I think last time I just took everything out of my closet. So that's what I'm going to do it again because like there's so much stuff on my floor and most of it is clean. Like most of it just needs to get back on the hanger. There's so many empty hangers because I just like kept like trying things on and then, no, I don't like that. Trying things on, no, I don't like that. And then this is literally from a trip last weekend. Like we're chucking everything out of my closet right now. And like these shoes, I literally just worked out. I love when my room's clean. And I hate when it's dirty because like duh, like the duh. Okay, let's chuck everything out of here. Ready for the show? <laughs> I didn't wear like any of this clothes. Uh, there's like a couple dirty things in here. Now let's begin the organization. There's not that much I need to get rid of because I did a closet clean out like two months ago. So there's not really that much I need to get rid of. But we're definitely going to be organizing because let me just show you. This is the current state of my shelves. Like how am I supposed to find anything when everything is like tangled up within each other? So we're going to do a better job. And then like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Unpopular opinion. I love organizing. I'm kind of a control freak. Not my greatest trait, but it's okay. So like when my room is like this, Sometimes I like it because I'm like, hey, bet, like a really nice reset, clean day. But then sometimes I get so overwhelmed with like the state of my room that it actually, I'm not functional. We're not going to be perfectionists, Allison. Just fold the pants. I want to go into next week and this weekend with like a clear mind and a clean room because I have a lot going on. And next week is actually spring break. Not like this week coming up, 
but like next weekend starts spring break and i am beyond excited so 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 pumped because there's so much fun content coming we're going on a trip and i'm just so excited for all that is to come in the next couple weeks but i just can't do anything if my room is dirty so that's what we're doing right now i also turned 17 in about like two weeks that's kind of mind-blowing i keep forgetting and then i'm like wait my birthday is literally at the end of this month which is crazy but i'm really excited because we're gonna be on a trip for my birthday and it's just gonna be so awesome you guys are just gonna chat with me while i clean my room and organize everything so if you guys are currently sitting in your room and you're looking around like dang i could really clean my room right now pause this video get up and let's chat while you clean your room and you listen to me talk while i'm cleaning my room okay so let's do that having like a clean environment i swear it just makes everything better so that's what we're doing the second the sun is like out the uv is high like i swear my life just like does a 180 like the past couple months have just been like a huge blur honestly because i honestly can't recall like anything that's happened in the past like three months because i've just like been hibernating i've been on like autopilot which like obviously like i've been enjoying life like you know like every moment whatever but like there's nothing compared to spring and summer when i'm just like my best self so i'm defrosting right now and i don't think there's any better feeling than that i'm so it sounds dumb but i'm so serious we're gonna attempt to put this entire stack of christmas pajamas that i accumulated all this past christmas i had zero christmas pajamas before this past christmas and then i just like went on a huge freaking spree of christmas pajamas and now i have like 20 but we're gonna try to fit them all right there so we have athletic pants and then christmas pajamas and sweatpants oh i caught you we're working our way up so next is jeans which i do not like a single pair of these jeans like none of them i don't know why I don't know if it's like, I don't know. I tried some on the other day, didn't fit me. I want to say she's like, my butt's getting bigger, but like my butt is not getting bigger. Like that's just like an excuse I'm saying, but like there's no way my jeans don't fit me. Like I've gotten skinnier. Why is it not fitting? I could throw all these away right now and not miss them, but I'm not going to because I know that like a week down the line, I'm going to be like, oh crap, I need some jeans. So I'm not going to do that, but I could totally do that because they... And jeans are so expensive and they're so hard to find good jeans. Like, oh my gosh. It honestly makes me mad because I don't like any of these. And they're all like the same thing. Ugh. The good thing it's almost summer so these will not be getting worn. When back to school season comes, I'm probably going to do like a whole huge closet clean out. Get rid of all of these jeans and do like a huge shopping spree. So, stay tuned. First stack of jeans. Don't wear. All right, jeans are done. I love the look of like stacked stuff. Like when things are organized, it's so like satisfying. It just never really looks like this. It looks like this for like maybe a week after I do it. But then like once I start getting laundry baskets, it's just like shove it in there. I like, throw it in there and I'm like, okay, I'm done. I gotta put my clothes away. I can go to bed now. All right, we did flare leggings regular leggings and then athletic shorts and now for like the worst shelf <laughs> it's my shorts um we have like beachy shorts we have sleep shorts and we have denim shorts there's a lot in this one single shelf but there's just nowhere else to put everything so it fits there but that shelf gets so crowded oh goodness Ooh. I forgot I had all this stuff. Everything is jammed in there and then I forget I even own half the stuff. Oh my gosh. This drawer right here, you guys are going to see it when I clean it. Bad. Because I wanted to wear a long skirt one day. And you can't even like close that drawer because of how like messy it is. So we need to clean that one for sure. I have so many pajama sets now. Like a little bit too many. My mom went a little overboard. Do you guys want to see all my denim shorts? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, shelves are done. Alright, all of the shelves are organized. 
the short shelf is overfilled but it's okay it's okay it's okay it's okay now we're just gonna shape up the shoe rack a little bit because it's just a little bit unorganized all right i kind of just organized them a little bit i'm trying to fit more shoes on here because i just got a new pair of shoes they're actually like a little early birthday gift um they're so perfect i love them they're so summer and i just really really like my white um platform adidas so i got them in this blue color these are the gazelles i got them off of goat because they don't sell them anymore on adidas so i didn't get them off of goat but they're so pretty I'm so excited. I'm wearing them this Sunday because I'm going to like a little coffee shop after sunrise and I love the gold details and everything. Just perfection. So we need to put these on my shoe rack. Okay, closet is looking so much better, but then you turn around. So this is the next thing we're going to work on. I'm going to first put away all my laundry because once I put that away, I can like put the clean clothes in my closet and put the dirty clothes in the laundry basket so let's put all of the clean clothes away this is my favorite thing to do ever let's put away clean clothes can you tell i'm lying currently 10 18 let's see how long this takes all right it's 10 24 that took me six minutes which is actually like really quickly basket's empty so now i have to like sort through this and find clean clothes and dirty clothes i'm like sun drained right now like I'm so, so, so hot, so we don't have that much left to do, but like my drawers are so stuffed, like I could totally clean out my tank top drawer and like my skirt drawer and everything, but like that sounds like so much work, but let's just first get through this. These drawers are like barely opening, so we definitely need to organize these, but I am exhausted. It's only 10.30 right now, but I've had the longest day ever. I've been up since 7.30, I had practice, I went to the beach for like forever. I drove like four hours in total today. I'm like sun drained. So I'm going to pick this back up sometime this weekend, but for the most part, I'm happy. I just wanna make my bed. So I think that's the last thing I'll do. And then like the little stuff I'll do throughout this weekend. I need to organize those drawers and my bathroom drawers and then just clean up my desk. And that's all. But like right now let's make my bed so that I can have a good night's sleep. Because I've been sleeping on my unmade bed for like three nights. So, so let's make it. I'm doing it the wrong way. And I'm so lightheaded like I'm going to faint right now. <sighs> That's not attached for right now because I'm gonna like overheat and faint. See you when I see you because I can't do this right now. All right, guys, it is two days later. I'm feeling much better. I was so sun drained that I literally just like passed out right after I stopped cleaning. And that was me yesterday, too. So today it's Sunday. We're getting our life back together. So we're gonna finish cleaning. I only have to clean two drawers right there and then my bathroom drawer, and then I'll feel content and pretty organized all around those two drawers my like skirt drawer and my tank top drawer are literally on like the verge of like exploding so we really need to clean those and just like organize them and then lastly my bathroom drawer is just very packed and just needs organizing so those are the couple tasks that we're going to take care of today i had my mom help me make my bed um when she got home that night and because i literally was like you know like when you just don't feel good and they try to do something and it's not working and it just makes you so mad because you can't do it that was me so i was like i don't care i'm sleeping on the bare bed but my mom came home and helped me so my bed was made thankfully it was not the best sleeping on a bare mattress kind of gross but now it's looking pretty clean for the most part and my closet looks good it's just if you try to open the drawers it's like bad so let me 
get to the eye. I already showed you guys, but like, look. It literally like explodes, it, like puffs up. So let's do that. I love my maxi skirts. I really, really do. So we're just, and these are like also like linen pants and stuff. There's just like a lot of it and it just needs to be folded properly. So that's just what we're gonna do now. It's really not about getting rid of anything. I'll probably do another closet clean out where I truly like clean and like get rid of stuff in a couple months. It's just, I just did one. So I feel like right now there's not much that I would want to get rid of. All of these linen pants are so unbelievably wrinkly because they've been in here for forever. Oh my gosh, look how wrinkly this is. And it literally has like stains on it. This is like my brandy skirt that I wore everywhere in Europe. Why do they all have some sort of stain? Like literally every single pair of pants or skirt that I've pulled out has a stain on it. People have been asking where this yellow maxi skirt is from. It's from Glassens, which I'm pretty sure is like an Australian brand. I got it last year before Hawaii, and it's really pretty. All right, it's still pretty stuffed because there's just so much, but I definitely think that's better. Okay, way better. Now we have the tank top drawer, which is honestly way worse, and there's just so much more in that one. There's so much. I'm not even, no, 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 I can't. There's, there's no way. This is gonna sound like an excuse, because it is. I don't wanna clean that. Cause like the second I have to put my clothes away, I just throw things in there. Like it does not stay clean and organized for the life of me. So we're just gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it because it's summer. Like I'm gonna be reaching in there every single day. Like, no, we're not doing that today. But let's do my bathroom drawer. There's just so much like packaging and like, it just needs to be organized. This is literally the only drawer I actually reach for. So this is like the only one we're actually gonna do. This I don't even use. I have so many different treatments that I've gotten from like my dermatologist and like all the boxes are in there. So we're gonna take out the boxes and just put everything in this little bucket. These pimple patches. Okay, there's literally one single one left in here. So we'll put it in the one that actually has a lot. And then this one, I don't think, oh, this one has a whole thing. I'll put that there. Okay. I need to clean the hair off of this brush because that's just really gross. We have my face wash and my moisturizer. We have my brush, we have my teeth whitening and my Mighty Patches. My mascara remover for at night and then some pimple cream. Toothpaste, obviously. All of my different creams. Then we have this, this is for like ingrown hairs. I don't really use it often. But I don't even know if it really works, but I have this. We're going to put this here and this back here. And that looks so, so, so much better. Now we're going to throw all this away. And now we're done. I feel so good. Resetted, feeling clean. And now we can just take on spring, summer, and all to come. So thanks for watching. My room's clean now. Definitely the before and after is crazy. Like, look at this. Maybe it doesn't look that crazy different but it feels like the vibe in here is just so different because it's actually clean but i hope you guys enjoy this video and i will see you guys in the next one